SMT Nation, we back. Nation, this article from Monica Alvin, Fierce Wireless, is really good. It describes kind of the, the spending habits of the wireless network consumer. You and me and the rest of us here on the channel. And we're paying more for service than we ever have. In fact, just specifically in the last year, 5% more over the, over the course of the last 12 months. Anyways, let's discuss the contributing factors. Let's talk about consumer spending habits and uh, what we can expect moving forward in the future. Link for the article will be in the description. Ways to support the SMT YouTube channel productions can also be found there. All right, so Americans are spending on average $1,342 per year on their mobile wireless service. That is up 5% year over year, according to uh, DOXO, DOXO, whatever. Uh, DOXO Insights report for 2023 Size the overall market, revealing that Americans spend $175 billion annually on mobile phone services. They then take that and probably divide it by the number of estimated connections in the country. 94% of U.S. households with a mobile phone bill spend a whopping $119 per month or $1,428 per year. And that's, ah, man... So, and that's not even the full detail. They've got a state by state breakdown. Hawaii is the most expensive at 165 bucks a month. West Virginia, Wyoming, they're close, coming in at $143 and $142. And then Connecticut at $139, Delaware at $138. So those are your most expensive states. Now with respect to cities, Boston, most expensive at $211 per month. Kansas City at $143. San Diego, at 131 then portland and san francisco at 126 now phones are expensive right most phones now are a thousand dollars or better pro iphone samsung galaxy whatever right those flagships are a thousand dollars right that's not coming down so that'll continue to accelerate in pace you'll be seeing 1200 1300 dollars for a smartphone probably here in the next couple of years now with respect to wireless trends you know what's the consumer going to do you got relatively high inflation rate still right no matter what the fed tries to tell you or no matter what the economists will try to tell you the the it's, it's expensive you know to, to to purchase things you're getting less stuff for your ducats you know and and people look at their wireless service as a must you know and and to be honest with you guys it is a must but what the consumer can do is they can navigate those waters carefully right they can make negotiations and take to lower cost plans and take to lower cost phones and look to bundle and, and find convergences and synergies where they can save, right? And that's why I think if you look at the most active promotional carriers, how customers see they can save money on a phone. And then you also see the convergence factor. You see people leaving fiber for fixed wireless access because they might save $20 a month. These things are glaringly obvious. The inflation hurts. The pricing is very high relative to earnings, you know, for folks in terms of their salaries. And they're trying to find ways to make this all work. I do not expect this number to be lower next year, right? I expect this to be a 5% increase annually moving forward. I don't think that's going to change, right? The cost of owning and operating networks continues to increase. More and more tower sites are getting upgraded and built, getting higher capacity fiber circuits. Networks getting more reliable and redundant, offering new accesses and things like that. Yeah, it ain't going down. Your prices are just going to go up. And be it through price increases on legacy plans or moving to new modernized plans that have higher costs, right? And improved experiences. That's just the way it's going to be, you know? Uh, but tell me what you guys think. Do you agree with my take? Do you think that's going to be the case moving forward in the future? Do you think we're going to stall soon? You know, pricing will stabilize. Uh, I don't think so, but. What say you? Sound off in the comment section below. You all the voice of the people, the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard.